Hi, my name's Peter, and welcome to Talk to My Guitar. This little guitar show where me and my guitar are talking a little bit to you, the audience, what is currently going on in our mind. And I translate a little bit for you what my guitar is sometimes telling to you. Okay, now the guitar told us we feel bluesy today. Actually, we were working on a composition, um, very dark and uh, brooding blues. And uh, we really love this kind of sound on the guitar. This one here, this drop D thing. You just tune down the low E string on a D, and then when you play the D chord, with the, all these open strings, really sounds great. See, when you add some cool wah, you start to talk with your guitar. Then this is getting really dark and brody, what um, you actually want, or what we actually want. So how does this cool track work out, which we are working currently on, we're currently working on, and um, well, I'm going to play it for you. That's, uh, I think, that's the best thing we can do. And so on. That's pretty cool. It's really dark and brooding. So um, maybe you want to have a closer view of what actually is happening on the fretboard. I think this is useful. And then we get to the more interesting stuff, like what we're going to freak out on that one here. Okay. Actually, this thing is pretty easy to play since we are in drop D tuning. Um, you have the open D string. And we use this. And distortion level is like on six or seven. That is really get this crunchy and uh, brooding sound. And then uh, we have, it's pretty easy to play. We have here in the seventh, fifth fret, uh, finger picking, open D string now. And then to five, four, four, two. Oops. And now comes my really favorite part with the open strings. The low, the the lowest three strings, and the third and the fifth. That's very cool, actually. You play that one three times. And now comes the second part. That's a very easy one. Just open D string. Twice, then three, four, three times, and then uh, anticipated on G five. In this case, since you have a D open D string um, tuning, you have to press in the fifth fret and in the third, and that's it. Then and that's the whole riff. So let's check it out. How it sounds really cool. I love this one. And so on. Really cool stuff. Uh, yo, um, actually, this track will be um, the title song of uh, my live stream project jam session egg.com. Uh, you will have some further information about this later. Yeah, that's the main theme. We're gonna, uh, it's uh, it's going to be composed for jam session egg.com, the center uh, where we're going to have uh, we are live streaming. Um, 
my students playing with me or me playing with somebody else or other musicians playing with opening acts gonna be really cool stuff um, it's already it's, it's ready now we have two cameras it's like a television studio i really love it and and this is going to be the title song um, so i don't want to that you uh, miss that title song of the jam session nick.com page um, i have to tell the other guy the webmaster to translate it to english still not saying german how do you think about this guitar jam session nick.com oh that sounds exciting yeah it's pretty um fizzily about that one so um what shall we play on this track is very cool stuff is possible um of course d minor pentatonics keep it dark and broadening also in the soloing just really and work with the wah wah then you're on the right path from that one let's check it out cool thing with the wah but you don't really have to play um, really wild stuff it already sounds wild but give really punch in the whole thing and when you play some repeating stuff fast let's see if i can do it without warm-up <laughs> Yeah, works. <laughs> Play some repeating st uh, patterns with the wow and then you sound really wild on that one here. And enjoy this dark brooding title of this upcoming um, jam session egg.com project. Very cool. What a guitar says about this one here. Is a pain in the ass, really. <laughs> That's really funny. Why is it a pain in the ass? Ah, because it's still not translated English. So um, you have to uh, activate the Google Translator. Okay, you like the idea that the audience can translate it. Um, <laughs> Yeah, that's how it is. Okay, have some fun with this dog brooding blues here. See ya. <laughs> 